All right, let's take a look at the forecast. We'll start with the next three days. Today on St. Patrick's Day, a quiet weather day. We'll have more clouds and sun. It'll be mostly cloudy, but we will get milder, believe it or not. We're in the low 40s now, but we'll flip the numbers and get into the lower 60s to mid 60s later this afternoon. 52 tonight with a shower. There'll be some showers Friday morning as a cold front will have passed and we'll only be up to 55 and then we'll dry out Friday afternoon. But it's in between that we have to alert you for. Tomorrow is going to get up to 72. That's nice. What's not so nice is we're going to see severe storms probably, probably in the afternoon hours. And you can see this because a moderate risk doesn't happen often here, and we're under it for tomorrow. The timing, 2 p.m. in the western part of the viewing area, uh, really in the western part of the state, 3, 4, 5, 6, really right in central North Carolina, and then after 6, east of I-95, the way it looks. But I'm going to keep the window open from 2 to 8, but with the prime time being, let's say, 4 to 6, when we'll probably see. Uh, I'm predicting some severe storm warnings issued and maybe even tornado warnings issued. We'll see large hail too. So damaging winds, large hail and isolated tornadoes. That moderate category right here, what it means is widespread severe storms are likely. Not that they just might happen. They're likely to happen. Widespread wind damage is likely. So we're probably going to get numerous wind damage reports tomorrow afternoon. And if a tornado does develop, it has the potential to become a strong tornado. And we could see destructive hail. That is possible, too. And we have a pretty good chance of seeing hail, uh, which is, you know, not the most common thing around here. But we have a 30% chance of seeing some hail. But the big key are the damaging downburst winds from the thunderstorms of 45%. That's almost a 50-50 shot. That is very, very high. Uh, tornado chance, if you want to look at the pure odds, a 15% chance. But you know, even a 1% chance you get that tornado, you get that tornado. And once again, the window is 2 to 8, but I'm really gearing into 4 to 6 in the afternoon tomorrow, and we'll keep on top of it as that occurs 